Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy Jimmy. Welcome to the channel. New, welcome back if you're not. Yes, your boy's back. I know it's been a while. I know, I know, I know. Cool, cool, cool. I've been, I'm back in college. You know, I'm, I'm working. You know, I got a lot of stuff going on, but I got some time on my hands, so I want to cover some more content on the channel. You know, some more Marvel Rivals content, some other things I've been seeing while I've been gone. So expect a whole bunch of videos and stuff to be dropping. Random stuff that see, it might seem like it has no rhyme or reason or order, and that's because I've been seeing it, but I've been gone, so I haven't had time to like post it and edit and all that stuff. Jeez, my beard is in my hair. I got a trim my beard is in my mouth i gotta trim <laughs> either way uh if you enjoy the content if you guys like comment subscribe all that good stuff uh but yeah expect uh a whole bunch of random videos dropping I trust it it's it's because i've been working i've been working on it when i got time i just haven't had time to upload it's stuff like that but um yeah we're gonna be covering marvel rival stuff um and all the stuff that i i didn't miss but didn't cover on the channel so expect to like all the previous gameplay or character reveals all that good stuff uh there are some creators that have access to the game so we'll have more gameplay that we can watch and kind of analyze the character get a good idea of what they can do all that good stuff so expect that stuff of course all the future marvel rivals content that's gonna get dropped in the next you know month or so because the game drops december 6th i'm so excited uh but yeah let's get into this marvel rivals dev vision because that's what we're going to be reacting to today and this is kind of like their their roadmap if you will talking about the game and all the things that we can expect on launch so uh let's get it guang guang i'm happy to share with you all the latest news regarding the marvel rivals roadmap firstly my biggest thanks to the Marvel Rivals community for sticking with us. They got a kind of a little groove in the background too. I'm just I'm just excited. <laughs> We've been working around the clock to fine tune the game for launch. Mm -hmm. Everything from perfecting our roster of heroes and villains to enhancing the stages, refining systems, and ironing out the last bugs. We're committed to making sure we deliver a game that's as epic as the Marvel Universe deserves. So, mm -hmm. bear with us just a bit longer. Hey, all good. Thank you for all your all your all words, all your hard work, Guang Guang, and the Marvel Rivals team. Y'all going crazy. For those who have been keeping tabs on Marvel Rivals, you've seen a 33-day countdown, starting with the big green guy himself. Mm -hmm. Ages ago, Hulk was the first hero we built. His ability incredible leap setting the tone for our quest to make it unique and make it crazy. Mm. As the countdown ticks down on our starting line up of 33 heroes, That's interesting. the final hero to be revealed will be sure to excite. Especially the team up ability with the Hulk. With Hulk? So, oh, sorry, my phone. <laughs> also, real quick, what do you all think? So, they, they, they said that final hero should be sure to excite. Who do you think that hero is? Because they have a team up with Hulk. Who do we not have yet? Hmm. I gotta think. And, like, what's the what's the correlation with Hulk? And what the what could the team up be? Because, of course, you gotta think about the MCU and stuff stuff coming. Like, would it, would it maybe be Red Hulk, maybe? Maybe that's the... I don't know, though. That's, that's two characters kind of do the same thing. But Hulk has, you know... The Red Hulk will have some fire stuff going on, some heat stuff. But, hmm... I wonder, I wonder who that, who that, who that last one would be, or maybe like leader or something. I don't know. <laughs> Let's keep it going. I, I want to theorize about that a little bit though. Team up with the Hulk as the last hero. Hmm. Come December 6th, players will get to jump right into season zero. Seems right. Over the course of this month long kickoff season, we will release a total of 33 heroes. It's just insane. On launch, 33 is insane. Eight maps, conquest, and a practice range. Nice. New practice range. Doom's Rise. Chronoverses. Okay. Where even the gods can die. Wow. That's cool. And we have eight maps that are going to tell us that story. That's cool. <clears throat> kind of nine because we have conquest. Okay. 
This design stroke is the framework for all our four designs going forward. Well, we plan to launch each design with new content, heroes, maps, team up abilities. Okay. Maybe even new game modes. Heroes, maps, team up abilities, and maybe even new game modes. Three months. Three months. Okay. We're already laying the groundwork for next season, and it's shaping up to be something really exciting. Okay. Okay. That's cool. Okay. So it's kind of going to be like um what we can expect from or, or what we usually are we expect from uh kind of live service games kind of like this anyway uh like your overwatch obviously is going to be your direct comparison you know what we kind of expect from getting in seasons like that so that's cool so three months and we can expect uh team up abilities is interesting to me because always that was the one thing i always thought like would team up abilities be like exclusive and static to when a new hero drops or would they like try to expand and like try to add more team up abilities to like existing heroes on the roster i think that's interesting and i hope uh i hope it's not just character specific uh if it is though it's fine because i mean it, it could get a little bloated at a certain point however it would be cool if like a season maybe we don't get a new character but we get a team up ability because they're already dropping 33 new heroes that's a lot <laughs> that's already a lot so it would be really cool if like we're we get team up abilities in a season like hey this is the season you know for example like the new captain america movie's coming out soon or or like fantastic four okay this fantastic four season or captain america season expect a new team of ability with captain america and bucky for example or like something like that um i think would be cool as well uh, anyway let's keep going monetization Mm -hmm. no Very important. Skin. Really good. Charging for power sucks. <laughs> okay. And to that, I wonder if, because uh, clearly I guess it'll be half half the price with a regular battle pass. I expect it to be like five bucks or something, because a regular battle pass is probably gonna be like ten. Um, but, uh, I'm very, I'm very curious to, to see if the season zero pa battle pass essentially looks like what the beta pass look like. Obviously there won't be like the beta exclusive rewards more than likely, uh, that you had to, would you would have had to get if you playing an alpha in the beta. Um, but I am curious to see if, if we're going to see something similar to that, that we saw in the beta, uh, with that limited battle pass. So, and maybe like, a I don't know, I, I expect a, a exclusive skin or something to the season. Um, but yeah. Interesting. Ooh, ooh, look at Superior Iron Man. Perfect. I love that skin. I want that one. The Amazing Bag Man. What's that? Uh, what is that? Eleven. What is that inspired by? Eleven Thunder. I know it looks MCU inspired. Okay. Oh, that's cool. Okay, okay. That's the, that's nice. That's nice. Uh, you can do that in uh, I think Valorant too, where you can choose a server. I'm not sure if you can do that in Overwatch. I'm gonna try. For sure. I'm surprised we don't have uh, Spanish yet. I'll be tripping. Well, there's tech support, but. But then again, Wang Guang looks Chinese. He's either Chinese or Japanese. I'm not racist. He's they're both Asian. <laughs> so I guess it would make sense. Um, okay, cool. And what's what's the what's the company for Marvel Rivals? I forgot. What's the company for Marvel Rivals again? I forgot. I don't know. Anyway, I think it's Netties, 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 something like that. Um, I might be tripping though. I don't know. Any, uh, anyway. <laughs> um, nice. December six, global launch. Really good stuff in here. Um, I really like uh, how much information we got. Honestly, really good. I like that we're not paying for power. I think that was a really good thing to mention. Um, we got confirmed thirty three heroes on launch. I guess that thirty third hero we're gonna see. You know, the the game drops is gonna be insane. To have a team of Billy with Hulk, I, I wonder who it is. Um, what else? Uh, 
the eight maps and one conquest map um conquest i'm trying to figure out if that's something that i'm missing right now that we've played before if that's something new conquest sounds new um could be tripping uh but um or it could be in something i missed and didn't cover fully yet uh but yeah really good stuff really enjoyed the 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 dev vision update the volume one uh appreciate uh guang guang for giving us all this and uh yeah um i'm excited for this game guys i'm not gonna lie so excited um let me know what y'all think in the comments about my arrivals so far all the stuff we got in this dev vision what are you guys most excited for let me know and also let me know if there's anything else you guys want me to react to outside of like it could be anything because i'm farming content it's about to be up <laughs> but let me know if you want me to play something react to something whatever it is let me know what you guys think about rivals and um yeah i'll see y'all peace